Yes, good evening. This is our last fight of the, uh, the night. It's been a truly spectacular night. I want to give thanks to everybody involved, but without further ado, we are watching our Bermuda Zone Corey Boyce fighting the Canadian. Okay, he's pushing a lot. Corey looks like he's taking his time using his jab. Okay, this the Canadian fight is Matthew Dion. Um, Matthew Dion's fighting with a lot of heart, but not a, a lot of experience. He's got a six and three, six and three record in the ring, six wins and three losses. Corey Boyce, I'm not exactly sure of his um, record, but he's been in there quite a few times, and he's looking pretty good. He's hitting him with some hard overhand rights at the moment. Um, not a lot on him. Of course, Corey Boyce is a footballer. He's well known in, in uh, local circles for being a good sportsman. And he looks accomplished right now. He's taking it. He's taking his time. I'm not sure if he's, this is showboating or if he's feeling a little wounded. I'm not quite sure. Sometimes you got to watch out for that. Our Canadian fighter Matthew is still pressuring him, so he's still got the advantage. Now, Corey Boyce now is doing a little bit of low, laying low on. So our Canadian fighter, Matthew Dion. Uh, oh. He, he, yeah, well, welcome back, Vincent. Well, so, well, well. so what's happening right now is that we got our local fighter, Corey Boyce. Um, he's fighting a very determined Canadian guy. Busy fighter. Yeah, Matthew Dion. Um, the first round went not a lot of, not a lot of um, definitive action either way. Matthew slight, slightly more proactive, slightly. Well. I would say that Corey Boyce took the opening round, 
and then uh, this guy Matthew Dion came back in the second half, and okay. so he kind of canceled it out. Okay. So if you were to ask me, Corey Boyce has got work to do in the second round, okay. right? He's here in Bermuda. He's a local fighter. He needs to show some dominance. Mm -hmm. Now, he was doing okay, but he eased off the pressure, and he allowed Matthew Dion to throw punches and look good. Mm -hmm. Whether they were landing or not, the judges will have to decide. Uh, as we've seen tonight, the judges see things that uh, ringside that we, we may not see. Yeah, totally, totally. Uh, and, uh, you know, as I um, see the uh, boxing commissioner just uh, give another shout out to Nathan Deal yeah. for all his visionary and work uh, sanctioning this whole event. But, you know, it's really been a few fights that have been a tale of two sides. Uh, yeah. two, or two, two different matches within one, one round. Um, you know, and I mean, sometimes it's been fatigue, and sometimes it's been Heart, yeah. Yeah, or even lack of technique. So. so right now, this guy from Canada has shown a lot of heart. Matthew Dion, you can't take that from him. So when it comes to... Yeah, so Corey's got to actually bring it up at upper level in the second round to make a decisive, um, to make a decisive statement. He's doing okay. But this guy from Canada, he's actually pushing it to him, and he's taking the fight to him. Yeah, he's going to have to fight one of his better fights, uh, it looks like, from here on out. I think so. Because I've seen the fact that Corey, yes, he's got good physique, good muscle, but this, this gentleman is coming forward. He ain't worrying about all that. He, he's hitting you, and when you get hit, if you're not able to get a clear shot, off, you, you got to protect yourself. Yeah. And so Corey right now is not being his most effective, so... Not a hundred percent. You gotta give a shout out to Matthew Dion for having his strategy and sticking to it. Yeah, and he's coming forward the whole time. He's not. He's not backing up. Um, Corey's not doing anything to make him to really back up. Not at all. I think Corey may be be the slightly better athlete, but he's not putting his combinations together in a form that's gonna make him say. I, you know, make his opponent say, I don't want to come in here anymore. Yeah, he's not even showing his athleticism, you know, for a lack of a, a better way of putting it. But, you know, it's still early. But you got to remember, if I'm coming into a, 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 another country, I'm looking to stamp my authority. And so when I see Corey, when I see Corey not stamping his authority and letting others stamp, stamp their authority on the match, it kind of gives me a little reservation, but... Right. Yeah, he's got that knockout power, so. He has that power, but he, uh, to me, personally, he needs to bring bring his, uh, okay, now he got a good shot in there. Uh, no jab, no. Yeah, no. but the optics again, uh, this guy, the Canadian guy, Matthew Dion, he's, he, he, he wants it. So far this round, or who you giving it to? Um, if it ended right now, who uh, you it to? I, I, I would have to say Dion, Matthew Dion. Good um, right on the head, and just yeah. as I say that, uh, Corey comes back with yeah. a few, but I, from Dion these last right few exchanges, exchanges yeah. he's touching him more, yeah, he is. and he's making Corey work. Head, body head, yeah. yeah. He's, yeah. He's being very effective. There you go. Yeah, see all that stuff that worked right there? Yeah. Corey covers up, goes low, which is okay, uh, but he's not giving anything back. So I would have to give that round to Matthew Dion from Canada. Understood, understood, um, understood. I would love to say it different, but it's not the case. I'm going to call it like I see it. Oh uh, no, and, and that and that's what we're here to do, you know, to go against our you know, emotions. Yeah. And just commentate on what we see yeah. for those who are not here. Yeah. So uh, you know, thank you for your your unbiased review, and I'm sure they appreciate that. Yeah. You know, it's round three. Uh, do we have another round after this? Yeah, well, no, it's only a three-round fight. Well, so, in my opinion, the only way that um, Corey Boyce is going to pull this off is be uh, really um, decisive, busier, and land more. There's no, he can't do what he did in the last round. He, he has to bring it to him. He has to say, I'm in control. So we'll see. He's got to stay in the pocket. 
He's going to want it, and he's going to fight for every three minutes of this round. That makes sense. Yeah. If he does that, he may better pull it out. But this guy from Canada, he's no slouch, man. Not at um, all. I'm going to remember his name, uh, Matthew Dion. He's taking it to him, you know? Yeah. Uh, um, Corey is not backing him off. Dion has got his high guard. He's fighting. He's punching him. He's more busy. He's, he's busier, should I say that? Uh, Corey has moments of brilliance, but not enough. No, not, not nearly enough. Not enough. And um, yeah, you, this, you this could be um, training, because he seems to be breathing a little heavy. He's this, a natural athlete. This would, a, a, this would be an upset to, to Bermudians, because they, they would think that uh, Corey, Corey would be one of the uh, sure, sure fights uh, on, on this card. Yeah, well. From a Bermudian perspective. Just, from a just Bermudian perspective. From, uh, from that perspective, yeah. I can understand it there. Not knowing, you know. But he needs to bring his work rate up. Yes. I agree. I agree. Um, I agree. He's an athlete, so we're kind of expecting him to give it up. He's um, rugby, right? He's a rugby player. He's a foot no, it's football player. Sorry, okay. he's more of a football player. Okay. Um, <laughs> but this guy, Matthew Dion from Canada, he's showing no backup, and he's actually landing a little more... Um, so he's looking a little more aggressive, a little more in, in control. Corey is understanding that he needs to pull something out the bag, and so he, here he comes. You know, enough respect. It is pretty cool. Um, but look at the look at the guard of, of Matthew Dion. He should be getting busy right now. Like Corey should be getting busy right now. Yeah. This and, last you know, round. What are you waiting for? Get yeah. busy. I I don't know if that's a matter of training or not. Now, I'll say that, and you, if you're listening, maybe you need to train for the fight game a little more, because uh, you're obviously fit, but throwing punches is a different different ball game. So, um, he's naturally talented, but right now, Matthew Dion from Canada is probably outworking him and, and looking a little more accomplished. Now, it's a good punch, but I don't know if you can win a fight over one, one punch. punch, yeah? That, it's no, it's got to be a knockout. Yeah, and I no disrespect to Corey Boyce, but his his hands are down, his head is down, and and Matthew Dion from Canada is 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 punching nonstop. You got to give it to the guy, man. You got to give it to him. You got to. And, you know, and, don't take it from him. And the busier fighter is the fighter that usually wins. Yeah, and, and that one right now is Matthew. Ten seconds. Corey's got to. You really do something magnanimous in the last yeah and you know i don't know about you but i, I think we're gonna have to get that one to the visitor uh, uh, straight up he came down straight here. up mate he came down here talking yeah. that talk and cory wasn't ready when that bell went you i think you saw what you needed to see no disrespect to cory but maybe he needs to bring up his fight game just a little another level he's got the natural talent uh, right but the now. guy showed that he wanted it a little more in, in this in this fight. You can say that again. In this fight. You can say that again. And shout out to Drake and his winning team of Canadians. Doing pretty good. Um, well, we know Corey well, will be back. Corey will be back to impress us. They will probably we take know. the victory in this uh, two out of three. They'll probably take this one. Yeah, we, we know we know Corey's got uh, a lot of good instincts in it. This doesn't change nothing about who he is, he doesn't change the button about by his ability. He just wasn't ready for this fight. Or, or didn't produce enough in this fight. Because uh, I think it's been maybe a year or more that Corey's yeah, and he's still breathing heavy. Doing fight training, you know? I don't yeah. think he's been doing fight training. Yeah. Fight actually. training is totally different. No, it's totally different. Good fight, uh, but dogs. but not decisive to Corey Boyce. Not at all. Uh, I would be a, I would be imagined to see him get anywhere different, right, man? So. I, I, I fully expect to see this in the red corner and deservedly so. Very true. Corey is still feeling it. 
Fighter of the Night awarded, and also the fighter, fighters of the night awarded, and the fight of the night awarded. Yeah, that'd be some interesting. A story. unanimous points decision. In the red corner, Matthew Graham Dion. Andre's fight a little bit better. I'm not sure. 